Linux Mint Debian Edition 4 is in beta. Hey everyone, what's happening? And today we are covering Linux Mint Debian Edition 4, codenamed Debbie, in the beta version. Um, today we're not going to be doing a full review. I will wait until it reaches a uh, stable release before I do a full review of it. We're just going to take a peek at it, see what they've come up with for this version and what they're testing out. And yeah, that's what we're going to be doing. So let's jump over to the desktop and take a look. Here we are on LMDE4 Beta's desktop. Of course, it's a Cinnamon desktop. They don't do Mateo XFCE editions of LMDE for now. So uh, we're going to go ahead and take a look at this. This is basically stock installation. I have installed a couple things like Screen Recorder. I think I also installed Steam on here and a couple other applications. But basically what we have here is what you get on a base install. First of all, we're going to go ahead and pull up a terminal and run a uname. Dash is um, uh. And uh, 4.19 is the Linux kernel that we're using, uh, which I think is a little strange because this is based off of Debian Stable. I believe Debian Stable moved on to 5.3 kernel. But um, Linux Mint likes not to change kernels too often, so I think they made this uh, old stable kernel because uh, 5.4 will be the stable kernel soon. So... Um, this isn't unusual for Linux Mint. Uh, also, uh, what version of Cinnamon are we running? Let's go ahead and actually let's just let's just do a Neo fetch. Um, let's see. Uh, we're using Bash version five. That's actually a very very v recent version of Bash. And uh, four point four point eight. Actually, that is the most version current version of Cinnamon. So it's which is not surprising. I believe Linux Mint Debian Edition rolls forward their Cinnamon versions to the latest uh, versions because, of course, Cinnamon is developed by the Linux Mint team. Um, so let's go ahead. Let's take a look at how, what else is installed. Um, Steam is not installed by default. I installed that. I'm going to be doing some gaming performance tests, etc. Uh, I will probably tell you how they perform in games, etc. in another video. Um, gra uh, graphics, um, I installed Glimpse, but Pix, Simple Scan, and Drawing do are included. Um, LibreOffice is included. And uh, Firefox Web Browser and Thunderbird, all Hex Chat and Transmission, they're all stock. Of course, Steam. It showed up shows up there too. Um, Atom is something I installed because I'm because I was doing some text editing on this uh, version. It actually works pretty well for pro programming, but that does not come stock. I actually had to add a repository for that. Um, Celluloid, of course, is their video player, but that's uh, Linux Mint team's in-house video player. Rhythm box and simple screen of course while I'm using the cast of the screen. And of course we have the Linux Mint setting panel for Cinnamon. So basically it's Linux Mint that's based off of the Debian stable. That's all it really is. And um, for what I have seen so far, this is actually pretty stable. It works just fine on this older laptop without any problems whatsoever. It installed all the drivers it needed, including all the proprietary drivers that, that this laptop requires because this uses a Broadcom Wi-Fi code, which I plan on swapping out for an Intel version in a minute because I just want to use open source drivers. That was LMDE4 beta. It's actually pretty uh, fast and reliable as it is as in the beta, even though I don't suggest you ever use beta, ver beta tests 
as your daily driver. But I would highly suggest if you have a testing laptop or if you want to install this in a VM to play around with it, go ahead. I will leave a, a download link in the description below. And as always, if you like this video, go ahead and give it that thumbs up button. If you don't, thumbs down. And go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And I'll see you in the next one. If you like my content and wish to support my work, you can do so on Patreon. The link is in the description. Also, if you wish to see more, check out the videos on your screen.